What is going on, you guys? Alright, so, before I start this video, I want to give you an update on Angus. <sighs> He's been on vacation, but he did want me to send you all a little message. This is a message he, he filmed right before he left, okay? Good night, mates. I just want, want y'all to know that I'm going to be back on Friday update pretty soon. So enjoy the video, y'all. Alright, so... Today... I don't know if you could tell, but I had my permanent retainers removed. For those of you who, who have never had braces, once you have your braces taken out, sometimes... They put a metal wire between... Like, behind your teeth. And you have to take real good care of your teeth, because the wire could break, and it's expensive as hell. Dr to repair them well today we had them removed as you all know I've, I've been struggling with chemistry class and I talked to my teacher about it and she said that I could just I could go on the school's website go under tutoring email a tutor and go through tutoring and she's gonna drop some of my very low grades some of my very low homework grades some of my and my lowest test grade. And basically, after that, that's all she can do. Because there's only so much a teacher can do to help you. So yeah, this coming week is spring break. And I'm working on my chemistry homework at, at the moment. And so far, it's pretty hard. One, two, we actually have three segments today. The first segment, Benny's going to take care of. Take it away, Benny. Hi, everyone. Back to that Friday update. Okay, so, as you all know, we always film in Tristan's room. But a lot of you newer viewers might not know this, but he used to film it in school with his friends in his senior year of high school. The second fact is Tristan only ended Friday update back in 2017, but honestly, he did think he was gonna, he wasn't gonna do it anymore. But, but then he missed doing it and he rebooted it at October. And the third fact about Friday update is I'm actually basically a spoof of Scrappy-Doo. Ace the spoof of Officer Wembley from we do in the cyber chase and angus is a parody of a stereotypical headbanger i got new glasses and these are actually uv glasses that just didn't take the lenses out by the fifth fact the glasses i wear don't even have any frames in them ace has an has another segment he wants to do take it away ace mm. The segment I'm going to do is Ace's Advice. It's a new segment. First topic is how to deal with a bully. Now don't let that skit me and Tristan did a while back fool you. We were just having fun. How you really deal with a bully is five simple things. First off, keep in mind that, they're, that if they bully you, that's because they're miserable themselves. So... Keep that in mind. Two, if you have to respond to a bully, respond to them in a very, I don't care what you say, like, really? That's the best you got? And then basically insult them saying, like, my two-year-old niece could come up with a better insult than that. Just basically, if they're putting you down, respond to them in a way that says, I don't care what you say. That takes away their power. Three, talk to your friends about being bullied and maybe they can help. You never know. They might uncover something about your bully that you could basically blackmail them for. Fourth, and one of the most important, talk to a teacher, talk to somebody. Just talk to somebody that you know for a fact can help. 
only use this fifth one as a last result. Actually fight your bully. Actually stand up to your bully. Because it shows that you're not afraid. And it'll put them in, in their place. But only use this as a last result. That doesn't mean like, oh, you're being bullied. Beat the hell out of them immediately. No. 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 That is not okay. That'll get you in trouble, not them. So that's five ways to deal with a bully. Back to Tristan. Okay. So, I can't exactly say I agree with everything Ace said, but... I don't think you should fight your bully at all. Definitely talk to someone if you're being bullied. Talk to a teacher especially. But if it gets to the point where you're afraid for your life, talk to the police. They'll deal with them. And if you if you talk to someone about your about your bully, they'll either suspend your suspend that bully or expel them. But basically, your bully will be in a position to where they can never bother you again. And they'll learn their lesson. And their friends that heckle you, they'll get suspended too if they start bullying you. All you have to say is, that person's bully, like it, that, that person's friends are harassing me. And I don't feel safe being in school. So. So this is a segment that I'm going to call Tristan's Advice. Ace has never been, never been bullied before. I have. If you have friends that are also being bullied by that same person, that'll definitely help because they'll they'll back you up and saying yes. And all you have to do is like say, "Hey, my friends are being bullied by this guy, and so am I." They'll back you up, and they'll the authority figures will see right through your bully's lies, and they'll never trust your bully again. Because if you lie to an authority figure. Odds are, they'll never trust you again. I'm just saying. Well, anyway. I'm gonna get going, because I got somewhere to be tonight. Until next time. Nah, uh, 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 uh. No, no, no. Not, not yet, Tristan. Not yet. You haven't told them yet, have you? Uh, t t told them what? Uh, the, the new king being almost completely phased out. Oh, yeah. Thanks for reminding me. Okay, so a lot of my autism routine has been phased out. Now there are certain rules I have to, I still have to follow, but there are not very many of them. And basically, it's stuff that can be done at any point during the week and at any point during the day. So that's also some good news. That's all I have for for y'all. Uh, I'm Tristan. I'm Benny. And I'm Ace. We are the Friday Update crew. Until next time, see you everyone. Stay awesome.